hi guys you welcome back to web technologies still on the material design model firm set in which we'll be talking about the contact dialogue firm we still maintain the class model fade the contact form model the tab index which is minus one the role here is dialogue the area labeled by words by the contact form model. Let's get to look at the CSS for the contact form model. The padding 0 and 20 pixels top and bottom. For the model dialog, maximum width 600, margin 30 pixels auto. For the model content, background color transparent. For the MDL, no, that stops there. Back to the index HTML. So that's when we have the model dialog and the model content, which houses the button, the cancel button, you see it, or the data dismiss model. We have for the contact form, back to the CSS, we have the contact form, MDL card, the which should be auto, that's the mature design layout card. For the MDL card tie to the padding top should be worth zero. For the MDL card tie to and the model logo, the display should be black. The weight auto, the height auto, the margin zero. Padding 15 pixels. Border radius 2 pixels. And the border shadow based on the RGBA. We are for the MDL card supporting text. The weight should be 100 cents for the input which is the contact form id now which is for the input text we'll get there back to the index or html let's talk about the mdr card the houses word the mdr card tie to which has the model logo which is the logo now for the MDR card supporting text the house is the firm now we have an action of sendmail.php we get to talk about this in the next tutorial because we have a robust sendmail which is actually a PHP file that will handle the mail the full name, email address, subject, and message to its appropriate mail address. So we'll be actually be using the server here, or we'll be using the locals, which can be ZAMP. We have signed an ID to it called contact form. Now we have a class row. This is actually from where? From the bootstrap with a column of six. And big six, you know, like we actually demarcate the card given columns. The first column, you know, we have 12, which is splitted into two. The first for the MDL text field, which is the full name. The second for the what? The email address, the closing row tag. We now have the MDL text field of subjects we have for words for message now our button which is the send button that triggers the send mail php the closing form tag closing MDL card supporting text tag the closing MDL card shadow the closing contact form, the closing model content, the closing model dialogue, and the closing parent tag. That's just it. Let's get to look at the UI, which is the web page, the contact form. Can you see how it's been split into two? used this is being done by words by bootstrap 
Bootstrap assisted us in doing this, where we created the row and the column MD of six by six. So we have the full name, the email address, subject, and message. Then so the message, name, full name, and email address. And our send button. This send button will trigger the PHP file, which I'll be explaining in the next tutorial. Thank you very much for hanging out with me throughout the session. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Have a wonderful time. Bye-bye.